As the number of new coronavirus cases falls here in the U.S. In India, it has become the world's hottest or newest hotspot. The numbers in India are staggering. Hundreds of thousands of new cases being reported each day. And as the hospitals become overwhelmed and the death toll tallies up, some here in Palm Beach County are trying to help out. CBS 12's Lexi Nall spoke to a local doctor who is sending more than just money to India. She joins us live in the studio. Lexi? Liz, that's right. Today I spoke with a local doctor originally from India. She's been practicing internal medicine here in Palm Beach County for decades. So normally she's busy in the hospital, but these days she spends the majority of her time on the phone with patients in India who desperately need her help. For Dr. Sheila Shaw, the crisis in India is personal. I can count at least 15 to 20 people that I know who have died during this crisis in the last one week. Over the past few weeks, Dr. Shaw and other members of a local nonprofit have spent hours at a time on the phone with people in India. All day long, I'm all day long on Zoom meetings, I'm talking to people, whatever I can, day or night. Giving medical advice to those who can't get in touch with doctors. Doctors there are doing their best, but you know, there are only so many doctors. Reading lab results, analyzing symptoms, and helping people stay away from overburdened hospitals. But there's so much panic in the air, and everybody wants to run to the hospital. By counseling them, by telling them you, are, you don't need to go there. Don't go and expose yourself to the hospitals because you might catch another variant. Dr. Shaw is helping out through her nonprofit, Female Indian Physicians of Florida, who are also fundraising to help Indian doctors purchase oxygen cylinders, medications, vaccines, and other desperately needed supplies. We are sending immediately a whole series of help that he needs. President Biden also pledging aid to India yesterday, including COVID therapies and vaccines. I think we'll be in a position to be able to share, to share vaccines as well as know-how with other countries who are in real need. And in India, Dr. Shah says the situation is very serious and help cannot arrive fast enough. We need to do something. This is, this is a crisis. This is a crisis and we all need to help. Well, for more information on Dr. Shaw's nonprofit and fundraising effort, you can visit CBS12.com.